1945. Germany is losing the war, street fighting, building to building. Soldiers dying every time they peek around a corner to shoot. So German engineers ask a simple question, what if the gun could shoot around the corner? So the soldier doesn't have to. The answer, the Krumlov, a curved barrel attachment for the Sturmgewehr 44, bent at 30 degrees with a periscope sight for aiming. In theory, revolutionary. In practice, a disaster waiting to happen. Think about the logic. Urban warfare is brutal. Corners are death traps, but if your barrel can bend around the corner while you stay in cover, you're untouchable. The Germans manufactured 10,000 units, distributed them to infantry units on the eastern and western fronts. Soldiers were excited. Finally, a weapon that gives them the advantage in close quarters. They attach the curved barrel, load the magazine, take aim through the periscope, pull the trigger, and the gun tries to destroy itself. Here's what the engineers didn't account for. Bullets spinning through a curved barrel don't like physics. The rifling can't grip properly. The rounds tumble. They ricochet off the inside of the curve. The barrel heats up catastrophically. Accuracy beyond 30 meters, non-existent. You're basically firing in the general direction of the enemy and hoping for the best. But it gets worse. After 300 rounds, sometimes less, the barrel starts to crack. Metal fatigue, stress fractures. Bullets literally tearing the barrel apart from the inside. Some barrels shattered completely, sending shrapnel back toward the shooter. The weapon designed to keep German soldiers safe was now a threat to their own lives. Reports from the field were brutal. Soldiers abandoned them. Commanders requested standard rifles instead. 10,000 units manufactured, and the majority were ditched, buried, or left to rust rather than used in combat. The Krumlov promised to revolutionize urban warfare. Instead, it became a case study in what happens when engineering ambition outpaces physics. Germany built a gun that could shoot around corners, but forgot that bullets actually have to survive the journey. Because sometimes, the most innovative idea is just the most innovative way to fail. And in 1945, Germany didn't have room for any more failures.